Hello, I'm Stephen from PlayStation Universe and today I'm going to show you a good way to find the resources that you actually need to build your settlement. Uh, one of the biggest questions that we've had, the most frequently asked question, is where do you find certain resources? Where do you get uh, circuitry from? Where do you get copper from? Where do you get aluminium from? And it is through scavenging around um, finding certain objects and then scrapping them so you can build your settlement, you can build defence turrets and the like. Now there's actually a really good system in Fallout 4 where you can tag items uh, which is what I'm going to show you in a second and it means when you're scavenging around if you're only after certain items then it will flag them up. So here I am at the Sanctuary Hills um, settlement base so I'm going to head over to, it's quite a cool uh, radiation storm going on right now I'm going to head over to my workshop. So in your workshop you'll notice that there's items that are greyed out because you don't have the necessary material. So I'm going to show you how you can find that material more easily. You've still got to go around and scavenge. but uh... So here, can you see that magnifying glass at the top left? I was searching for copper, so I pressed R1 here to tag copper. And then whenever I'm scavenging around, that magnifying glass will appear next to any item that I'm looking at that contains copper. So it just makes it easier for me to um, find that particular material. So one of the earlier missions, you've got to find um, stuff for your settlement to make your defence. So this is where I first thought, oh, well I need fibre optics, I need nuclear material. You can see here they're greyed out. I've pressed R1 here to tag them. And then now when I go and scavenge around, that tag will appear so I'll, I'll know that contains fibre optics, nuclear material or aluminium which I'm after as well. So you just go into your workshop and you find those items that are greyed out and you press R1 to tag. Now I'm going to show you how that looks when you actually go scavenging. So you can find materials anywhere. Um, there's a hospital uh, which I found which had a load of material, had a load of circuitry which I needed. So you can see that there I picked up something that had the magnifying glass, light bulb, it shows me there that could have got the magnifying glass, that actually contains copper which I'm also searching for. So it means you don't have to pick up everything, you can just target those things that you need. And here a telephone's got the little magnifying glass so I know that's got something that I need, in this case it's uh, circuitry. A good tip for you, you'll need circuitry early on. So head to that petrol station which is near, near the first settlement in Sanctuary Hills and you'll find some circuitry there, there's a telephone on the, uh, on the counter. So that's it, I just wanted to share that little tip with you. We've got lots more videos, check out Carl's excellent walkthrough of his settlement which he's created a fantastic settlement. We've also got the review on PSU.com, we gave it 9.5, it's a fantastic game. So do go and play it and do follow PSU.com for, for more Fallout stuff. Thanks for watching.